Hey guys, it's Delisa here, and I have a vocal analysis video on Miss Miley Cyrus. Woo! Transformation and um, has become a bit of a rebel, but you know, you can't take away from her that she is a pretty good vocalist, and so I wanted to just talk about, you know, her in my vocal analysis today. So let's get into it. So her vocal fock. I believe that she is a lyric soprano. Um, her voice has the most presence in her upper belts, but she's more comfortable in mid belts. And um, the lowest that I've heard her go down to is an F3. Um, I think some people have said that it was lower than that, but I didn't really hear anything lower than that. She has a great mid med register and lower register as well. I just think that maybe she just hasn't figured out how to master um, her upper register, so people would tend to think that she just has a lower voice, but I disagree with that. Um, I think she has a very nice voice. I think she has a beautiful voice. I think she has a meaty voice. I think she has a kind of a steely voice a bit. Um, she sings with that country twang, that kind of, ah, she kind of on the vocal cords a little bit. It's usually a bit hard. It's definitely not finesse you know, it's not full of this finesse and she doesn't really sing on the breath. She definitely sings on the chords to kind of give her voice an edge or roughness to it. Because otherwise her voice isn't, I don't, well, I don't think her voice is rough. But um, yeah, so she sings with a nasal country twang. That's what I wrote down. Very fast vibrato, very expressive, very powerful. She's um very good at just uh, singing very emotionally, you know, emotionally deep songs. Um, and even power ballads. She's a great power ballad girl as well. Um, she has powerful belts between F sharp four and a C sharp five. I think that's really where she shines in the belt department. Um, her setbacks. I know you guys are still looking at me crazy because I called her a lyric soprano, but I feel like she lacks versatility in her technique. Um, she doesn't add enough head voice or place her soft palate high enough to sing with ease, which would really help her reach her potential. She has a lot more express expressive colors in her voice that's not being used because it's not developed. She will begin to deteriorate if she doesn't learn to sing off the voice soon. So, um, yeah, I feel like even though she has this great lower register, I don't really think it goes low enough or it's powerful enough to really consider her a mezzo-soprano. Um, I don't. I just think that she's another one of those lyric sopranos that just has this gorgeous lower register. Um, again, she doesn't really lift her soft palate high enough to really explore the E5's belting and the F belting. Um, yeah, she has a great voice, but not a lot of technique. So I feel like if she were to learn technique, it would kind of take that screech away, some of that nasality away, and she'd become a lot more versatile singer, and then she would be able to actually explore fully her range. So those are my thoughts on Miley. I actually think she has a really great voice. You know, given all of the um, upheaval, I guess, or controversy that she causes, I think she's awesome. Go Miley, keep singing. Okay. So, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Um, let's see. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know what you think about Miley's voice. I think she's great. Um, but she does have her limitations. And um, I will see you next Monday with another vocal analysis of your favorite singer. God bless. Thanks for watching.